Here is a drone video for a huge tract of land. Uh, this is showing that it's about 45 acres um, right in the heart of the Ozarks, actually in Ozark County, Missouri. So south central Missouri here. Uh, this property has direct county road frontage on Ozark County Road 158. This has power on site, actually does have a power line crossing over it. So you've got access to power. Uh, big, big, big tract. Um, so frontage on the county road and goes back to the west, way back to the west. Um, awesome property for hunting, uh, camping, recreation, uh, building with the power being right there. Uh, I mean, you you can you can do a lot with this property. This is a big one. So the truck is actually pulled off of the county road onto a little driveway there. It's near the power line, and we're looking westerly um, at at part of the property. This is a big tract, so I think we do a pretty good flyover. Oh, also this has Hurricane Creek crossing right over it, and I'm hoping we see that in the drone video. We'll we'll check in a minute here. So we're flying westerly, taking a look at the property. Uh, these tracks out here were logged within the last six months to, to a year, uh, and you'll see that it, it, it uh, they weren't clear cut, um, but you've got some open areas, you've got some wooded areas, mostly it's a mix. Uh, I mean, you've got hundreds and thousands of, of mid-size and large trees, some large trees left. Um, okay, here we go. And we'll be looking down on Hurricane Creek in a moment here. Hurricane Creek uh, is, a, is a small creek, and for the most part, it's it's uh, either a seasonal or wet weather creek, although you may have pockets of water in it, um, you know, all throughout the year. Really not sure about that, um, but there you can see right there. So you might have a, a little bit of water flow, but I mean, there will certainly be times when it's dry, uh, but it, it goes westerly, or goes easterly, about two miles into Bryant Creek. So yeah, that, it crosses right over the property. Uh, feel free to go and check that out. I mean, you're gonna find some cool, uh, some cool features in in any uh, creek bed in the Ozarks. And this is actually a named creek, Hurricane Creek. So that's pretty cool. So we've got this tract uh, priced just about as cheaply as we've ever had a piece of acreage. Certainly as cheaply as we've ever had anything with county road frontage and power on site. Um, Good opportunity. If, I mean, if you're looking for something with big timber value, uh, we've, we've got that too. Certainly the price will be different. Uh, if you're looking for something that's a great value for hunting or building re for recreation, uh, this is pretty awesome. As we go back toward the west, you've got a large open area. Oh, we just crossed over it, but maybe we'll come back to that. And we're still going westerly. Um, huge level area on the west side. It's actually level on the east side by the county road. Uh, it starts to gradually drop down and then it, it slopes down as you get to the creek bed, obviously, uh, and then slopes back up as you move past the creek bed, levels off on the west side where we are now. Now we've spun around and we're looking easterly. We're, we're over the property and we're looking easterly way back toward the county road. Right below us just now is actually a second small creek bed. Uh, that's an unnamed creek. And as we go back toward the east, so there's a, a very large open area. That was probably a landing where the loggers would have uh, cut the trees to, to size and loaded their trucks. Uh, but that's interesting because they could make a really nice site for a, uh, um, a home site or a campsite or whatnot. Spend a little time and do some cleanup there and uh, get some instant equity in the property that way. It's, it's fun with a, a property that's, you know, had some logging because you can go in and uh, I mean, you can you can clean up the entire thing if you want, or you can focus on a couple little sites uh, and make them just as beautiful as you'd like. Uh, or, uh, you know, probably the easiest thing to do is uh, just go ahead and use the property, hunt, camp, build whatever you want to do, and let Mother Nature do the cleanup for you. Because in just a few years, uh, the limbs and the tops and whatnot they'll they'll rot away, and these remaining trees will grow very very quickly uh, without the competition from from some of those larger commercial trees um, because I mean you've got 20, 30, and 40, 50 year old trees still on this property with a very good established root system with a very good canopy. Uh, they just don't have to compete with some of those uh, bigger trees which were probably you know bullying the medium sized trees for the resources for the sunlight and for the nutrients. Uh, so these trees that you see now they're gonna they're gonna grow like crazy. 
So there's a truck parked on the property. You can't quite see the county road. The truck is parked on a, a little driveway that goes into the property. Uh, forgot to mention it up till now, but instantacres.com is where you can check out all the details uh, if you're not already there. Uh, but that's our website, instantacres.com. Check it out. Uh, you can see availability uh, on any property. Everything we have is hand-picked, so we, we just have a few properties on the website. Um, but you can check out all the details. If this tract is on there, it'll be in the over 10-acre category because this is a large one. Uh, check out the, uh, the other videos. Check out the interactive map. Uh, super, super nice tract. Someone's going to be really happy with this one. Uh, pretty unusual to have a tract. Um, first of all, in, in this size range, most of the stuff we sell is is quite a bit smaller than this, so this is a nice tract. Uh, and then the county road frontage, uh, the power on site is a big deal. Whether you need it or not, it certainly adds value to it. And it's nice to know that it, it's there if you ever do need it. Uh, and then having that Hurricane Creek um, running right over the property is, is pretty cool as well. So instantacres.com. You can call us in the office or you can shoot us an email at sales at instantacres.com. And uh, we hope to hear from you.